We wait for the delay to strike. Get rid of some stuff over here. Might as well get rid of some stuff over here while we're waiting. 23 seconds or however long it's going to take. 19 seconds, 20, 21, 22. There's 23. Man, it's getting longer and longer, I tell you what. There we are. There we are. What's up, everybody? How's it going? Welcome to Wednesday. Finishing up our Blind Bag Live. An amazing, amazing haul thus far for Blind Bag Live. Really good stuff. Really good stuff. Who do we have in the house? We got Tyler Sato. Hello. What's up? Juan Viacorta. Hello. TNT Customs. How are you doing? Uh, I did do an experiment where I didn't do a community post <laughs> of the stream, so we'll see how that goes. Um, yeah, I decided just to try a couple different things out. Didn't seem like my community, community posts were helping at all, uh, so we'll see. <laughs> we will see. Uh, Alex's gathered, gathered Treasures, Gabriel jo Johansson, Rick plays, Dead Scary Boy, can't stay because he's got school. No worries, man. No worries. So we'll see. Maybe we'll just have tremendously less people than we did before. <laughs> and I'll have to do another community announcement because uh, nobody's going to be here. But we'll see. We'll see. Caesar Salad in the house. What's up? My chat on this is really delayed. Really delayed. So hopefully people get announcements. Uh, it's me, Rick Martin. Oh, Rick Martin is Rick Plays, apparently. <laughs> Your favorite mod. <laughs> well, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to I'm gonna have to moderate this channel as well. Right? Did that work? Your alt account for game videos. All right, we'll uh, we'll uh, moderate that one as well then. Hopefully, fakes for you. Brick of Vader in the house. What's up? What's up? All right, let's get started. Uh, it's not looking good. Maybe I should have done a, <laughs> a community announcement uh, that we were live. I might have to do that later on. I was just testing it. I was just testing it. We'll see how it goes. Anyways, uh, last bag. This is going to be kind of a short stream. Uh, I got tons and tons of organization to do. Today's my organizing day, so my dining room table is just full of these, just all over the place. Um, and, uh, yeah. Yeah. So let's go ahead and dive in. So we're going to do this. Uh, maybe we'll hang out, talk a little bit, but for the most part, I got some stuff I got to do today. I figured we got to we gotta go live, though. We got to give you guys some... Some blind bag live. We gotta finish off this haul. I haven't decided what I want to do about the, uh, the yellow bucket haul. Whether I want to do videos or blind bag. I kind of want to do videos for that. The pink bucket haul did very well uh, in terms of a video series. Plus, it's so easy to make the thumbnails for those. Uh, it just takes me so much less time. So, I think we might do that. I have a 15 pound haul of stuff that I got for really cheap that we'll probably go through as the next blind bag. And I'm waiting. Uh, on my wholesaler to call me back for like a zillion bazillion pounds of mini of mystery stuff. So hopefully, hopefully that works out. Uh, Brett Builds, what's up? What's up? How you doing? Captain Chris Bricks, hello. How is it going? Eh, we're about the same. As want to do the community post or not? <laughs> it doesn't seem like it's any different. I don't know. I can't figure out YouTube. <laughs> we haven't grown in in. Uh, watchers in like a year and a half <laughs> we've just been steadily declining we gotta change up the content or something i don't know i don't know what's going on first thing of the day we have stas ali however you say her name ali ali, ali stas ali. uh there's the indoraptor's head i think we had the rest of the body somewhere in this uh rick rick wants to know is it hard to start up a youtube career since I'm planning on posting videos about gameplays but yeah uh yeah <laughs> Gameplay sounds pretty hard as well, um, just because, uh, yeah, gameplay gameplay sounds, there's a lot of people in gameplay, so I'm not sure. Uh, it's harder to get the, the community out to know where you are. I mean, there's billi there's millions and millions of YouTube accounts, so it's hard to get, uh, get everybody to know that you're out there, even for me. Uh, I have the YouTube channel, or I mean, I have the eBay store, which helps me kind of filter some people to my YouTube, but that's about it. Berserker from Lord of the Rings, that's a good one as well. We'll keep down here. I think this one is actually fantastic as well. This is the Forestman Nexo Knight robot guy. Just needs the hat, and I think that's actually a pretty valuable one, so we're gonna put that there. He does have the wolf, like the wolf pack, so uh, that's my boy right there. <laughs> we're gonna keep him down here, even if he's not valuable, that's my boy right there. Uh, we got some glued on legs. We're just gonna throw those away, because I don't even wanna, they're just blue, I mean, who cares? 
Uh, I don't think I'm going to keep any mass stuff. Mass stuff. How's everybody else doing? There's another ting of the day. Anakin from our gunship. 75021 gunship. Nice. Nice. Ralph Wiggum, what's up? Blurry? Is it blurry for anybody else? Not blurry on my side. Tony Stark and, uh, um, wow. Why can't I think of that guy's name? Uh, Red Skull. There we go. What are my thoughts on the Daily Bugle set? Looks pretty cool. I know a lot of people are really excited about that set. Um, so that's always good. People getting some excitement for superheroes. Because I know superheroes are kind of meh for quite a long time. Hey, we got her headpiece. Look at that. There we go. There we go. We got this headpiece as well right there. Just got to find the head. I'm going to use that one. By the way, from your last video, there's a Daredevil. I did hear about that last stream. Somebody said there's a Daredevil coming out. Uh, I did see that, yeah. Black Panther, rip. I think that's Killmonger, uh, to be honest. I don't know why I'm putting him over here. <laughs> These guys go over here. Uh, yep, mm-hmm, mm -hmm. I don't know. Brand, nothing. Marion from Indiana Jones, keep that one. There's a mustache friend. <laughs> I haven't seen that one before. Is that calico? Is that what they call those? Or just dirty? It's like a muddy tiger? I don't know what that one is. That's interesting. I'll have to look at that one. A million head. There's a fake. There you go, Juan. Right for you. Fake Bane. Fake Bane. All right. All right. Oh, there's another ting for us. I don't think he's supposed to have this sword, but uh, we have the new Thor from Ragnarok. I believe is what that's from. I haven't seen that. Wait, is this a different new Thor? This doesn't look like the Ragnarok Thor, but he's got printed arm. I have no idea. I'm going to put him right there, but I don't know. You guys can tell me. <laughs> I have no idea. I don't think I've seen that Thor before. Oh, I'll use those legs. I never sell that paddle on. Uh, Obi. The uh, leather armor. It's pretty cool. Pretty cool. Clone. Joker. With the coattails. Minecraft. Damaged clone. Or colored clone, I should say. Black Panther type figure with gold is Killmonger. Yep. Yeah. yeah, I thought so. Uh, plus blade with Punisher? Oh, with the, the newer figs that are coming out? Do you think the Star Wars minifigure prices will go down? Not in the in the near future. Star Wars is hot. Like, Disney's releasing a ton of stuff. I don't see it, to be honest. Maybe, like, when everybody's back at, at work and it's like, uh, you know, this whole thing's over, possibly you could see a little decrease. I mean, obviously, I'm, I've been increasing pretty much everything just based off of market. Some of them I don't remember, and I just post what they were for selling for, you know, forever ago. <laughs> just because I totally forget. Ouch. That's a good head, too. That's a avatar head. Man, that thing got chewed up. Um, but yeah, I don't see them going down anytime soon. Not like Bitcoin this morning. Holy cow, did you guys, everybody, anybody see that? <laughs> oh my gosh. Anybody invested in the crypto market? Holy Toledo this morning was something. Minecraft, creeper. That was, that was a little insane. Not gonna lie. Made a little money this morning. <laughs> Not gonna lie. Took advantage of that craziness. Always gotta, always gotta buy when peak fear. That's what they always say. Peak fear. That's when you make your money. When everybody's scared, losing all the money. That's when you make your money. It's a whole dolphin. Look at that. Whole dolphin. Our Lego Productions. What's up? What's up? Severus Snape says it's me, Ojax. Hi. What's up? The most popular video has 820k. I know it's propping up my whole life. <laughs> that video, that video is where we are today. Uh, we're close. We're close. We need like uh, 64 more subs, and we're at 10k, boys and girls. 64 more. Ninja Animator, what's up? Et. That is a fantastic Dimensions fig right there. Get that one in there. Oh, this is Finn, I think. Uh, oh, there's a good one. Mantis. From Guardians of the Galaxy. Last time I checked, she was really, really good. So hopefully that continues. Steve. 
you really want to start investing in a series, I have no idea where to start. Yeah, it's tough. It's tough. Just do your research. There's plenty of stuff out there nowadays to teach you. Plenty of YouTubers out there that are really good at, uh, there's some new Ninjago things I've never seen before. That kind of teaching you what's up. <laughs> what? Is that a superhero? Brick girl? Brick girl brick? <laughs> I don't know who that is. Brick girl. I'm going with brick girl. That sounds about right. It's a trap. Uh, there's one of the other new ones. Vermillion, cat girl, nothing super special. We'll keep that cat. Grand, grand, diver, nothing, nothing. Jago, Strepio. Oh, that stuff's good. That stuff's good. Kai. Ooh, there's a good piece. There's um, Hadras's head. Headpiece. Hard to find. Really hard to find. It's a good one. The bounty hunter head. It's good too. Another vermilion. Uh, what is your favorite Star Wars set ever? Speeder bikes. The old school speeder bikes with Endor Luke and the two scout troopers and speeder bikes. S nostalgia. Ah, oh, I needed these legs and somebody freaking chewed on them. <laughs> Come on. I need those printed leg clone legs. Jeez, people, stop chewing on things. Tell you what. Man, man alive. People just chew on things. I tell you what. It's crazy. It's crazy. Plastic. Doesn't doesn't taste very good. I don't get it. I just don't get it. Lego legs are tasty. Are the legs taste better? do the legs taste better? It's up to you with my two accounts moving in this one. Thank you very much, man. Uh let's Lego in the house. What's up? What's up? Why is Nexo not uh, in the Tinkpop? Uh, Waterborne Tropicals. I think this one is the Forestman one, right? Am I am I wrong on that one? Maybe not. He's got a wolf pack emblem. That's why he's in there. <laughs> if anything, he's got a... What is that? Oh, dear. Is that like a Five Night at Freddy's thing? Holy Toledo. I don't like that. I'm just going to... I'm just going to put that over there. I don't like that. <laughs> I don't like that. Do you keep any figs for your personal collection? Do you sell them all? Uh, Gabriel, the only figs that I keep are the really hilarious ones that are custom made by uh, people who I buy these lots from. You know, kids and things like that uh, that have made things that I find absolutely hilarious. I will keep. Uh, other than that, everything is for sale. There's a fake clone for you. Hello from Germany. Kevin W. in the house. What's up, man? Namesake right there. Stormtrooper? That's a good one. That's a good one. Guess that head, everybody. Time to play Guess That Head. It's a beige head. What's it gonna be? The Nexobot came in a big castle from the third wave. Uh, Doc Ock. Not the good Doc Ock, either. Wah, wah. C-3PO. What was... Why is he so, why is he rattling? Oh, jeez, hello. Oh, somebody put Play-Doh in him. All right, cool, cool. I'm just gonna take that out. Uh, that's a Black Panther fig. I don't remember what her name was, though. There's an Elves fig. Some of these Elves figs, oh man, I had no idea that these Elves figs were so valuable. I tell you what, holy cow. I had absolutely no clue whatsoever that those were so valuable. Hello. Wait, where was the guy that wears it? I didn't see the guy that wears it. We got Kilo's mask in the house right there. That is the most expensive Oni mask you can find. That is a solid find right there. Nice. I like that. I like that. Take that. Just got another Cloud City Boa Fett with uh, old Jabba the Hutt. Nice. For like $700. Shuri? Featherhead, your name? You paid $700 for it? Is that what you're saying? Bought it for $400? $700? That's real. It's real, real, real. Real, real good. This looks fake. Wait. Wait. Is it just the head fake? Wait. They printed on a body? 
This says Lego, but the legs don't. What? Maybe they printed it on a body? Well, now that's just confusing. It doesn't feel like pad printing. It doesn't look like pad printing. That's weird. It's like the torso is real, but the head and the legs are not. Or they just printed the whole thing. I'm just going to put that in a as a fake anyways, just because I don't even want to risk it. <laughs> I don't even want to bother. There's a good helmet there. We got Django Fett in the house. Uh, it's the wolf pack breast tile there. That's also why he's there, because it's a wolf. And I mean, come on now. Wolfpack. Let's go Wolfpack. Actually, my uh, my college that I went to in Reno, their mascot is the Wolfpack. So, that's pretty cool. Uh, Mothman, what was it? Moth, 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 um, <laughs> I was going to say Mothra, but that's the Godzilla monster. Uh, Moth, 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 what is it? Killer Moth. Killer Moth, that's what it is. That's Aaron's bot, the green Nexo Knight guy. So, oh, is the, uh, is the Forceman one have a brown? I think I have a couple of those tiles. I don't know. There's Gree. Is Gree a Ting now? I don't know. I mean, it's pretty cool. I guess we'll put, we'll put it down here. It's, it's, it's cool. He cool. He cool. He can go in the, in the cool pile. Uh, is this one real? No, that's not real. Meh. Meh. There's a Stone Warrior. Series fig. There's an old knight. That's pretty cool. That's pretty cool. One of the newer Robins. I think this Robin's actually pretty good. I'll have to look. Phase 1 Grease sucks. <laughs> I mean, come on now. Let's be gentle. <laughs> the Exo Force. Who is that? I don't know who that is. It's something, though. Got a uh, Foot Soldier. <laughs> The, inv the Invisible Man. That's, that's pretty good. That's pretty good. It's pretty good. Uh, Scarecrow. Those are always good. Scarecrow's good. Republic Trooper. Meh. DX Zane. Meh, meh, meh. Meh, meh. Darth Vader. What's that hairpiece? That's weird. Trapper. Horseman has the classic deer tile. All right. All right. Yep, that's no force, man. <laughs> Fair enough. He's cool. He's got a wolf on him. Come on. There's four long. Not much any, anywhere there. Four long. Uh, Dalmatian. That's pretty cool. Some good head pieces. Oh, wait. Wait, wait, wait. I think this is... This is this guy. Oh, I think there's an eBay auction ending. Hold on. Hold up. I think we got that. Oh, no. How long have we been going? Oh, no. I think I, I think we missed it. Oh, no. Oh, no. Did we miss it? Oh, no. Uh... I don't think we missed it. Do I want this, though? That's the question. Here's the question. Do I want... It. Take a look at this real quick, because uh, we might have to just win an auction alive. Mm. Mm. We're playing the uh, the game. Does Kevin want things? Yeah, I don't know. I don't know if I want things. Yeah. It's a little sketchy. Uh, and yes, you want it. <laughs> Check your Insta. Hey, do you have both the Time Twins from Nidago for sale? Uh, I think I just sold the Time Twins that I had. Uh, if I'm not mistaken... I think I just sold the the time. I don't know if I want this. I don't know if I want this lot. 
check my Insta later. Later. Do I want it? Do I not want it? I don't know if I do. Mm. Nah, not really. Wasn't bad. Uh, what is it? This lot right here. Uh, I don't know if you guys can see it phone to phone. There were some good things. There was a uh, Phase Two clone. There was a um, oh, there's a Inquisitor there. I think there's two Inquisitors in here. Oh, Light Up Vader. Oh, I mean, some. I'm gonna go back on this and be like, why didn't I buy that? Oh, there's the uh, Fifth Brother. That's a good one. It's a good one. Ventress. It's a good one in there. Hulk. It's a Dewback. We just miss really not a whole like ton of really good things though and it went for like 300 bucks so 320 after shipping there's a veers that's a pretty good one i don't i don't know if that was a super good deal so i'm okay with that i'm okay with losing that i'll keep the 300 dollars myself um yeah you guys got to see that live would have been more fun if there was a purchase live but you know Things happen. <laughs> Trying to see if uh, there's anything else I'm gonna miss out on. No, okay. All right, cool. You see a gold ninja? Uh, okay, what did I miss? Uh, building some new speed champion sets, nice. They accidentally put, uh, put it out on the shelf, <laughs> they brand new. Uh, oh yeah, we looked at time twins, no, I sold those to Caden Britton in the house, what's up? What'd you miss? Three hundred dollars? Are you mad? No. There was, I mean, that was a pretty good deal. Uh, I'd say, yeah. I got so much stuff to go through. I don't really. I don't really need pretty good deals. <laughs> I, if it's a really good deal, then I'm all about it. But I don't. I don't really need pretty good deals anymore. <laughs> okay. Interesting. Hero Factory. See a gold ninja at the top. There we go. Oh yeah, let's Lego wanted me to check Instagram. Let's take a look. Let's take a look what let's Lego has to say. Oh, he was texting me the picture of the uh this Cloud City. Cloud City guy. It's pretty cool. What did you pay for it? Uh so. I saw a lot of the Cloud City stuff. Like Cloud City Luke's gone up quite a bit. I saw a lot of the uh, the Cloud City stuff seems to be seems to be going up quite a bit. I think that's the Ninjago Pirate, if I'm not mistaken. Superhero guy. Uh, what do we need? What do we need? There's raised headpiece. That's good. How many figure many figure bags do you have that you haven't open checked? Uh, I don't know. A lot. <laughs> <laughs> a lot. Uh, Savage Press. Good one. I don't even know, really. Uh, my back stock was getting managed a little bit. There's a pizza. Uh, and then I bought a whole bunch more stuff. So, this is my life. And um, just when I think I'm going to get caught up. Oh, there's an Iron Man. Missed that guy. Just when I think I'm going to get caught up, I don't. And uh, I order more stuff. And see. Rick Martin doesn't help because I almost ordered that lot and I was like, should I do it? And he was like, yeah, do it. You know, that doesn't help me. Doesn't help. Doesn't help my addiction. <laughs> I gotta get some of this stuff. Uh, why do you think Lego are going so highly? There's a perk hitting them all up. That's why. There's probably a couple guys who did them all up, but to the point where they don't even make sense. I will tell you firsthand. Wow, why am I lagging? Everybody else lagging? Uh, I will tell you firsthand that the prices of LEGO Star Wars, if you are a reseller right now, don't make any sense. <laughs> just from years of experience, just know that I have not been buying Star Wars hauls because it's too much. 
It just does not, it does not compute. No lag? Okay. It does, there's somebody out there who I think maybe just wants to get into reselling uh, and is just buying everything as their strategy, but it's not, it's not how it works. Like you have to have a price algorithm that's going to make you money. And really you have to get these things, you know, 70% off at least. Uh, you know, 20% off doesn't get you anything because it costs 20% to sell this thing. You get 10% eBay fees, 3% uh, payment fees, then you get shipping. So overall, just on average from my eBay store, you're about 20% in the hole from selling anything. So if you think that 20% off is a great deal for something, that ain't going to work. So if you're paying $500 and the Star Wars lot ends up being worth $550, you've lost money by selling those It's at, at full retail. It's just insane. It's stupid. It's insane. I don't know why people are doing it. Um, but yeah. Live in Canada. Is your EBS store available for, you, for me? No, not quite yet. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I really, I keep saying that we're going to do it. And I keep getting distracted. Kind of like everything else in my life. <laughs> I keep saying that we're going to do it. Uh, and then I keep getting distracted. And that's just, uh, that's my life. Uh, you have a price algorithm, says the one who spent 60k on plastic bricks and car for printed boxes. <laughs> I only spent 31k. That, that haul, I only spent 20k. It was worth 60k. And most of those are gone. I think there's probably a couple that are still left. Most of them are gone, though. It's alright, still enjoy the content. Thanks, man. Thanks. Uh, Canada is an eventual. Canada will probably be first, to be honest. I don't think Canada shipping is that bad. I'm just scared of all the custom stuff and it taking forever to get places and whatnot. Um, I, I don't know. It's just it's one of those leaps that you have to take that I'm just, I don't know if I'm ready to take it. Uh, but Canada would definitely be one of the first ones uh, if we did decide that that was going to be the case there. Would say the same after I'm bankrupt. Uh, are the Lego Angry Birds still popular? Because I hardly see any of them anymore. Um, I actually am trying to build a full Angry Birds lot, like a full on, like every Angry Birds made, because I don't think so. The only one that's super valuable that I saw is the Eagle, uh, which I have, by the way, got that in one of those hauls. Um, but I haven't seen the, the, uh, the value of any of the other ones go up very much. So I don't think so, but I don't know enough to say for sure if that makes sense. All right, anybody have any other questions? I told you we we're gonna do kind of a short stream. I just wanted to finish that blind bag uh, lot up. I'm still deciding on the yellow bucket haul. Uh, I think we're probably going to do it as videos, but I have like <laughs> I have like 40 videos post or uh, ready, to, ready to film, or not ready to film, but ready to post, uh, which is kind of funny. <laughs> but I'm kind of trying, what I'm trying to do now is I'm trying to get because I used to, I used to like film a video, and then I wouldn't have gone through that stuff. So the video would go up because I'd film the video and I post it the next day, uh, and so the video would go up and none of that stuff would be for sale yet. So uh, I got a lot of people kind of saying like, "Hey, where is this?" And I was like, "Oh, it's not posted yet." So I, I figured I might as well get a whole huge backlog of videos, uh, and then from that, when I start posting videos. As long as they're not sold, obviously, some of them sold real quick. <laughs> but uh, as long as they're not sold already, then the stuff that people see will actually be in the store, and it'll make a lot more sense for an advertising uh, perspective. Uh, so Mighty Eagle is the only popular one. Yeah, uh, not popular, but the only uh, more expensive one. Let's take a look uh, on Bricklink. For some reason, Bricklink's getting tagged by my antivirus lately. <laughs> I don't know what the heck that's about. My antivirus does not like... Bricklink at all. It's like, nah. Nah, how about you don't? How about you don't do this? Angry Birds. Let's take a look. I gotta figure out how to do the, the Stream Deck stuff um, to kind of show my screen to people. That'd be really cool. Uh, let's take a look at the angriest, or angriest, <laughs> the angriest of the birds. Uh, so Mighty, Ing Mighty Eagle, King Pig, and the Bomb are the only ones that are over like two dollars <laughs> well, on Bricklink. Uh, obviously eBay you get more uh, than that but yeah Mighty Birds or Mighty Birds now I can't even speak. Angry Birds not great for resale. 
He bought a sealed dead man tell no tail ship between by the way mid condition took me three ribs but it was worth it spent 250 on it that is sealed that is great deal rick it was a great deal do you have a link to your store yeah um if you're in the u.s dot ebay dot com it's just stores dot ebay dot com slash like bros i only sell in the u.s though for right now if you're uh if you're in the u.s eric you can do that Seems a bit few and far in between for us trying to get into reselling. Wish I could find more. It's tough. Yeah, I mean, I, I started at a really good time. I wish I had started years early, earlier, because there were lots that were going for like $20. Like, people used to sell this stuff for nothing. Nothing. And now, I think, you know, Derek, Pops Walk Shop, and I have helped that. <laughs> the resale market has kind of figured it out a little bit. Um... And that uh, that has made it so that uh, there's a lot more people buying stuff and, and whatnot. So it's it's definitely hard to start right now. I would say uh, maybe give it a little bit till things start coming down. Possibly I don't know if they ever will, but you never know. What old show you wish they could make sets on? My choice would be G1 Transformers and Tron Uprising. G1 Transformers would be awesome. Absolutely, I would buy the heck out of those uh, if they made those. If they got that Transformers license, but Creo has the license, right? All these ones, uh, I don't know how long ago they made these, but this was the uh, the license for Transformers, I think, went to Creo. So I'm not sure Lego's really interested in it, but I think it would, you know, after the Voltron one, they showed that they could do some transformation stuff. So I think it would be a really cool thing to get G1 um, Transformers in Lego. That would be really cool. I think it would be a very, very good adult series. Um, I think it would do well because they're really trying to push adult Lego right now. Like, have you, if you've noticed, though, like, they're going hard. Like, obviously, they have Ninjago and stuff like that for the kids, but they're going hard on adult sets. Um, and, you know, they're, they're really, I think that's what they're trying to work on the most. <laughs> Adults have money, is kind of how that works. So I think a, a G1 Transformers would be fantastic. I can help start on Mercari. I don't really have any interest in trying to manage another uh, inventory. That's the problem is you have an inventory on each one. It's really hard to store all of that stuff separately. And then you have it like on one platform and it sells on the other, but you didn't know that you had another one on this one. It didn't sell at all. Uh, it's tough. Butt job in the house. Shout out to Pops Block Shop. Of course, of course. Absolutely. Shout out to Pops Block Shop. Got another timer going off. I don't know what that's all about. Uh, let's take a look here. Let's see, what do I have? What do we have a timer about? Uh... Uh, that 10, 20, 30, okay. Yeah, timers, timers, <laughs> life timers. Gotta go, take it easy, Juan. We got lots of uh, fakes for you in the last video that I posted today. <laughs> if you guys watched that, holy cow, so many fakes, so bad. Uh... All right, did we win that one? That's why I had a timer. There was another auction I was looking at today. Hey, we won that one. Uh, I'll give you guys a spoiler sneak peek. Not very much, because I got to do a video on it, but we won that one. <laughs> was that enough for you to see? You worked for Derek last Saturday? Oh, it is at the, uh, the, the convention or whatever they did. Watch for video on his channel and mine as well. Nice, I will, absolutely. Do you ever buy through OfferUp or Facebook Marketplace? Uh, I've heard that there have been really good deals. People have told me like, hey, there's a really awesome deal and I've been too late for them. I don't look to myself. I'm not super looking at buying stuff right now. Like I, like I just bought one thing right there. I, just every once in a while, I'll, I'll find some stuff, but I'm not looking at buying super heavy unless it's a sealed collection. Our business account is in the spot where we really need to buy another like $30,000 haul uh, of, of uh, sealed stuff because we're low on sealed stuff right now. Just minifigures galore is what we have right now. Uh, but it is a good, I know you can find some good deals on OfferUp and Facebook Marketplace for sure. I know that's where um, Rick finds a lot of his stuff, I think, for sure. What Iron Man figures do you have? Wait, what Iron Man figures do you have need to add a few more to my collection? Oh, uh, Kane, if you're in the US, you can just search Iron Man on my store and you'll see all of them. I mean, obviously, I have a whole bunch more in the back. <laughs> But uh, not how much. Uh, Waterburn Charcoals, take it easy. Much love from Holland. Right back at you, man. Have a good night. 
Commander Pro Cody prices, I think he's still about the same. Uh, let's see. Somebody's trying to buy, buy Marcus right now. I go Commander Cody. I don't remember what set he's in. All the custom ones, of course, come up. Uh, somebody going to say what set he's in? 7676, that's right. The gunship, right? 7676. Right now, Commander Cody has gone up a little bit. Uh, let's see, U.S. Uh, some, wow, they're all over the place. <laughs> somebody selling brand new for 30 bucks, and then somebody selling for 45 bucks, and somebody selling for $99. <laughs> I don't think he's worth $100. Um, that's pretty crazy. But, you know, I, I might have to put some... Cody's up in the market. <laughs> I have a whole bin of Cody's. Uh, so I probably should get some of those up if they're going to go for a hundred bucks. Is that what you're talking about, Brick Blast? Is like how, how, how far it's gone up? That's nuts. Marketplace and Facebook. Yeah, Rick Rick Martin's the one to ask about those for sure. There are actually a lot of steals sometimes. Yeah, I just don't have... I've never actually even had a uh, Facebook account, so I don't ever think about going on there. Take it easy, Caden. Muhammad, what's up, man? What's up? All right. Uh, anybody have any more questions, any tangents you're going to put me on to keep me away from uh, working? Because I should be uh, organizing right now. If you guys could see my dining room table, it's a complete mess. There's probably, if I had to put a rough guess on it, probably about 15 pounds of figures on my table right now that I'm trying to sort through <laughs> from all the flying bag live videos uh, and all of those kind of things. Trying to get a collection of the commanders. I did sell one of those a while ago. Um, which is a steal now. I think I sold, I think I sold every commander for like seventy five dollars as a lot. And now Rex is like fifty plus by himself. That's crazy, crazy. Somebody just bought uh, Hera. It's a good one. Stream it. If I if I ever take this business over and I don't have to work my other job, kind of like Derek does, if I ever actually go full time. I definitely could do some fun stuff with YouTube. It would definitely be one of the ones that I um, that I would want to expand because it's really fun hanging out with you guys. Maybe do some sorting and all that kind of stuff. More live streams for sure. You want to see your dining room table? You haven't flown me out yet. <laughs> oh, butt shop. Would a Lego Unknown Cryptos theme? I don't know what that is. Act to Mimi. I have no idea what you're talking about. Sorry. You heard prices are very high. For Star Wars, what are the themes good to buy right now? Ninjago's pretty good. Uh, Ninjago's tough. You just sell it right. Single figs, yeah, it's tough. <laughs> and Ninja some Ninjago Ninjago's hit and miss. Star Wars everything went crazy. Uh, but I don't think it's I don't think it's slowing down to be honest. Disney's cranking out Star Wars, and I I just see it getting more and more, more and more crazy. All right, anybody else have any questions? This is your last chance. I'm gonna get back to work because um, we actually went farther than I thought. Derek was live today while you're what? I didn't see that he went live. He didn't notify me. Marvel's going up. Uh, some Marvel. It's it's kind of like Ninjago. Very hit and miss. Scary monster videos? Okay. Which stormtroopers should I get a lot of from what era? Classic. Dotted mouth. All day long. Is this dotted mouth? No. It's not dotted mouth. Dotted mouth. The old school dotted mouth stormtroopers. All day long. All day long. So we're gonna be live tomorrow. Uh, yeah, probably. Unless something comes up, we'll probably do live tomorrow. Do you think that there'll be a point where it would go down, possibly rebound up again? I, I don't see it. I don't see a reason for it to. With Bad Batch restarting the Clone Wars, people are gonna rewatch re the Clone Wars, uh, and I just I see it surging. I don't think it's going down. <laughs> Which is probably why that guy bought all the Star Wars stuff. <laughs> That's probably probably what happened. I don't know. I, I just don't. I just don't. Hopefully not, because my business involves that. But for you guys who are trying to buy them for collection purposes, obviously that's something's got to change, because th things are getting a little out of control on some things. 
Prices on clone troopers have gone insane. Yeah, I mean, I'm selling them on Bricklink for eight bucks a piece uh, with no accessories whatsoever. I used to sell them, like, the highest I ever got for clones was six bucks a piece, but I had, like, cap, like, a commander and, like, accessories with all of them, visors and all that kind of stuff. Now I'm getting eight bucks a piece on Bricklink, and they're not even, no accessories or anything. It's crazy. Uh, I think I'm up put crosshair on my Imperial Army. Nice. Speaking of the Bad Batch, I'm planning on buying every set they will put out so I can resell the figures I got dupes from. Yeah, man. Good chance to sell everything Star Wars we have right now. Uh, yeah. And it's, it's never been a better time to sell, but it, it might go up. I mean, but right now, if you've been sitting on things and you need money for something and you need cash flow, Star Wars figs, hit me up first. I mean, obviously. <laughs> uh, but, yeah. Okay. People are dropping out, so I think we'll wrap it up here. Sorry for the short stream. We got a couple things today. Not a bad bag. I'll take that for a pound bag any day of the week. Really barely anything that's just meh, so that was fantastic. That whole lot, that whole haul was fantastic, so really love getting things like that. Uh, Kevin loves spending money. Absolutely. Whoever has a sealed collection out there, hit me up, because we're ready to buy. We are ready to buy. Just bought a massive lot on eBay for 150 pounds. Could send you some pics on Instagram of it. Nice. Nice. Wish Star Wars would dip like the crypto recently. <laughs> yeah. We were talking about that earlier. Oh, man. I woke up this morning. Holy Toledo. I saw that downdraft. I made some money on the uptrend, though. But, uh, wow. That that was insane. <laughs> that was insane. I don't know if it's going to, you know, come back from there or if it's going to just have fun because traders loved pushing that down and then bringing it back up. We'll see what it ends up doing. Uh, who just sold here? Just sold two things while we were on stream. Uh, Hera, Sandula, and a uh, Boba Fett. And possibly Marcus if this offer is high enough. Not quite, not quite high enough. We'll see about Marcus. All right, everybody. Uh, but I don't have a second one. Thank you. Sell my Dead Men Sailing the Seal set. Uh, that's one of the ships I don't have. Yeah, that's that's one of the ships I don't have. It's one of the ones I gotta get. We'll see. I'm gonna send this guy a message for Hera. All right, everybody. Uh, have a great rest of your day. Take it easy. Thanks for tuning in. We found some cool stuff. Cool stuff. Um, Stores.ab.com slash leg bros, where you can find it. Instagram with zero. Because Instagram, uh, leg bros, Instagram with a zero? Instagram leg bros with a zero, because leg bros was taken from some brute of a person. I don't know. <laughs> Anyways, everybody, stay safe. Have a great rest of your day. Hopefully, you guys can have some fun. I'm going to get back to work. I got Organization City going on. I'll probably post these up pretty quick here as well. Uh, so if you're looking for them, that's where they're going to be. Take it easy, everybody. Peace out.